in the same season or indeed in, in any season. Gordon Elliott, if he were to win this with one of his uh, seven runners now, then he equals the record for winning most trainer in Grand National history. And of course, Derek Fox will join an elite band of jockeys to have won it three times if he wins on last year's winner, Corrick Rambler, having won it on one for Arthur in 2017. <laughs> Last amateur rider to win the race was two years ago. Sam Whaley Cohen on Noble Yates. He retired from the saddle immediately. That horse now ridden by Harry Cobden, champion jockey elect in Britain. Glenn Gooley is way in front of the others at the moment. So that won't be a goer. A final thought, Martin. Yeah, I just hope that all of these horses behave themselves down at the start and we get a, a, as clean a start to the race as we could, Nick. They're coming into a line now. Far fan racing in the Randolph's Grand National of 2024, heading towards the Melling Road in the first of 30 fences. Manila Kruner is up there. Late night pass over on the far side with Farouk Delen. Korak Rambler handy with Nasalam and Glenn Gooley. Manila Imdo just in behind as they reach fence one. Rider at fence number one, last year's winner, out of the race at the first this time. Nasalam prominent with Manella Kruner and Glenn Gooley as they come down towards fence number two. El Dorado Allen and Manella Indo also prominent. Foxy Jacks is well up there towards the outside. They're all safely. The knot, there's one down at fence. There's the loose horse who fell at the back. Korak Ramdi just took another tumble. Here's the open ditch. Glenn Gooley, Manella Kruner, Foxy Jacks, El Dorado Allen, then Manella Indo, followed by Farouk Delen and Galvin. Late night pass wider out and then Coco Beach. And to the inside, Aya Maximus, then the Gother and Kitty slide as they come to take the fourth. It's Glenn Gooley who landed out in front from Foxy Jacks, Manella Kruna, Farouk Delen, late night pass, and El Dorado Allen. Then came Nasalan, the Gother, Kitty Light, and Manella Indo as they approach the fifth. And Glenn Gooley just about the leader with on the outside is Foxy Jacks, Manella Kruna just behind these with Farouk Delen in the white cap wider out late night past the grey is El Dorado Allen as they head down to beaches. Nasalam is chasing them with Manella Indo and then back in the field to Delta work and on the inside Vanillier in a red jacket, one of the greys as they jump Beaches Brook and Glenn Gooley is safely over and they're all safely over Beaches Brook. Mr. Incredible is well back towards the inside and also towards the inside at at a rear as they move on towards the next plane fence and over this one it's Glenn Gooley that leads the way Noble Yates is one of the back markers at the moment Glenn Gooley from Manella Kruna and then right up on the outside Foxy Jacks in the dark blue jacket El Dorado Allen as they now reach the canal turn they're followed then by Manella Indo who goes well into about fifth place followed then by Farouk Delen uh, Coco Beach is handy Iron Maximus in a white cat just tracking them from Nasalam and late night past Glenn Gooley at Valentine's and Statler's been pulled up before Valentine's as the others get their way over it. Marlin Mission made a mistake. He's just about bat marker. Also, Noble Yates is well behind at the moment. On to another plane fence. It's Glenn Gooley from Manella Kruner. Foxy Jacks in the dark blue jacket. Then El Dorado Allen, followed by Coco Beach and Farrick Delen. Another mistake from Marlin Mission further back. Nasalam, Kitty's like Galia Dilato, adamantly chosen. And late night pass all chasing up the leaders at this point. Then Iron Maximus now to another open ditch. Watch him get over there. Marley Mission still right up the back. Limerick Lace and Noble Yates also some way toward the rear. So Glenn Gooley led as they approach another plane fence before they head towards the race course proper. Glenn Gooley over this one in front from Foxy Jackson second. Then El Dorado Allen. It clad to rear to made a mistake there. Farouk Delen was also a little untidy. Glenn Gooley from Foxy Jacks as they head towards the Anchor Bridge crossing. Then El Dorado Allen and Benella Kruna from Galia de la Toe, the Yellow Sleeves. Then Kitty's Light and Late Night Pass from Nassau. Salam, Manila, Indo, and Coco Beach. Delta work, Galvin, Capitano, the next ones. From the Gotha in the blue and the red, then Janadil, adamantly chosen, and Wa Marge. Mac Totti back through them, alongside Eclat de Rea, Mr. Incredible. Mac Totti, some way towards the back of the field with Chemical Energy. Noble Yates, the last one turning for home this time. So onto the race course proper, and the leader is Glenn Gooley in the hands of Michael O'Sullivan to Foxy Jacks. On the outside, Manella Kruner and uh, Kevin Sexton. The black and white followed by Farouk Delem. Manella Indo quite handy with El Dorado Allen and Galia De Lito. Kitty's light not too far away with late night pass out wider as they meet fence at 13. All of them managing to get over that. Chemical Energy is just in behind the front uh, seven or eight. Getting a little bit closer is ain't that a shame. 
And uh, Nasalam is still just following the leaders with Manella Indo as they jump what will be the last next time around towards the rear. Mr. Incredible with Mac Totti and uh, Limerick Lace after a, an earlier mistake towards the back with Panda Boy and Noble Yates and uh, Harry Cobden at the back of the field as they come to the chair. Fence number 15 and it's Glenn Gooley to Foxy Jacks, El Dorado Allen and unseating at the back, Marla Mission went at the chair and Mr. Incredible as well. Marla Mission and Mr. Incredible both went at the chair as Glenn Gooley leads them to the water to Foxy Jacks. Manila Cruda, El Dorado Allen is up there on the inside. Late night pass and Gina Andrews out wider with Farouk Delen fairly handy and then Manila Indo and Rachel Blackmore, Nasalam, Galia De Lito, Harry Skelton, Kitty's Light is there just better than midfield with I am Maximus on the inside and then Galvin and ain't that a shame and David Maxwell followed by Vanillier last year's runner-up and then Capo Dano still in the race with Limerick Lace and Janadil and Panda Boy. Chemical Energy has lost a little bit of ground. Mac Totti is towards the rear and Noble Yates is still at the back as the field crossed the Melling Road and are about to lift off at fence 17. Late night pass, Manella, Kruna, Foxy, Jax, Glenn, Gooley, Eldorado, Allen, the leaders from Manella, Indo and Nassalan close up behind the speed, along with Gallia de la Toe, and then Ain't That a Shame in the red and brown. Kitty's light goes well, a little bit deeper out on the circuit in those red sleeves as they race towards another plain one. It's Foxy, Jax, Manella, Kruna, Kitty's light, Glenn, Gooley, Manella, Indo, Nassalan, Farrakh, Delen, and Ain't That a Shame. Many, many chances going towards the open ditch now, fence number 19. Glenn, Gooley in the centre in in the red from Foxy Jacks, El Dorado Allen, Minella Rindo, Galia Diletto, late night pass wider from Minella Crune, then Kitty's Light, the Goffer, Meaty the Waters, and Ain't That a Shame, followed then by Galvin, out Dell to work, on towards another plane fence now, Glenn Gooley in the centre, took off in front there, leading from El Dorado Allen, Minella Indo, late night pass, Minella Crune, and Galia Diletto, then Kitty's Light, Foxy Jacks has lost a bit of ground, Wamarge is coming into it, looks like Mac Totti's going to be pulled up at the back. El Dorado Allen right up the inside in the centre, Glen Gooley, wider out late night pass in the red and white jacket, then Manella Kruner, Gala de Litteur in the yellow sleeves, Kitty's Light, and then Marge a little wider out. I am Maximus going well on the inside in a white cap as they arrive now at Beaches Brook, and El Dorado Allen was the leader, and I am Maximus made a mistake, and a worse mistake by Noble Yates, who was struggling a bit anyway, as they run on now towards the Foynaven fence, and it's El Dorado Allen on the inside of Glen Gooley, Galia de Letour. Out wide then is late night pass from Manella Indo. After these towards the inside, Coco Beach still handy. And then Delta work, Kitty's light well in touch and out wide. Manella Kruner as they arrive back at the canal turn. El Dorado, Adam from Glen Gooley, late night pass. They're very well grouped together. Way back at the end of the field now is Farouk Dalen racing on towards Valentine's. Glen Gooley, late night pass and El Dorado, Allen on the inside. El Dorado Allen led them then, just about in front there for a late night pass. Glenn Gooley still well up there in the red and white. Galia de Toe also nicely handy with those yellow sleeves. Kitty's Light, Wa Marge, Manella Indo, then Delta Work in Coco Beach. Farouk Delen has been pulled up before fence number 26. Foxy Jacks is now the last one going, although he's losing touch. They're racing towards the final open ditch. Fence number 27, four out. El Dorado Allen, late night pass. Galia de Toe, Kitty's Light, Meaty the Waters made a mistake. They've got one down at the back of the field there. It could well be Glenn Gooley. Glenn Gooley, the early leader, is gone. So Galea de Lito, El Dorado, Allen, Ian Maximus on the heels of the leaders with Coco Beach. Then Delta Work, Kitty's Light, late night pass. Foxy Jacks, Manella Kruner getting well behind. So too Chemical Energy. So approaching the Anchor Bridge crossing, Galea de Lito, late night pass, Kitty's Light. Then Manella Indo, right behind him with the blue cap is Delta Work. And then El Dorado, Allen, Ian Maximus, and Galvin, one the Goffer's got every chance. Meaty the Waters, ain't that a shame? Vanillier is now being ridden along. So to Coco Beach, and then Nassalam, and then Limerick Lace and Janadil. They head the way towards home. Many chances in the national. And it's Gina Andrews on board late night pass with a narrow lead to Galia De Lito and Harry Skelton. Manella Indo is just in behind with Kitty's Light and Delta work. Galvin has crept into sixth. Then Rawamar's just being chased along. Ian Maximus is next in the field, along with on the outside meeting 
of the waters. Late night pass just led over the second last. Kitty's light coming to challenge. Manella Indo is held together. Galia De La to just losing ground as Delta Work and Meeting of the Waters try and improve as they reach the 30th and final fence. Late night pass pressed by Manella Indo and Kitty's light. Meeting of the Waters on the outside. Delta Work is coming there. I am Maximus is also looking to get through. There's a loose horse involved as they run towards the elbow. Manella Indo and Rachel Blackmore to Delta Work in second. I am Maximus is in third. Kitty's light is in fourth. Manella Indo is pressed and passed by I am Maximus who starts to storm clear inside the last half furlong. And I am Maximus and Paul Townend streaking away to win the Randox Grand National. I am Maximus the winner. Second was Delta Work, Manella Indo, a fantastic run in third ahead of Galvin and Kitty's light. Ain't that a shame got round?